Hello everyone, I'm back, and um, I'm excited to bring you guys this episode. So what I've done while you guys were gone, uh, let me turn my volume up more. Um, what I did when you guys were gone was basically just improve the base a little bit, gathered a couple, couple more resources and stuff, and I made this storage room. Now, this is the wood area because it has a wood piece right there so this is where I'll store my wood cobble goes here crafted items goes here so like fences and ladders and stuff and then the sapling means miscellaneous so this is the storage area I can extend it and I can draw it, drop it back once I get more stuff um, over here I'm planning on doing farms I don't have sugarcane in this world so if anyone would be kind enough to, um, make this world, like, take this world into IMCP edit and put down some sugar cane somewhere because I don't have a jailbroken device, so I can't get sugar cane anywhere. So that kind of stinks. But what I'm going to be doing today is I'm going to look for some iron because I need better, better equipment. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and craft um, a pick because I did break the one that I had or it was in my inventory. No, I think I broke it. But anyway, I found a place to mine and I'm going to put a mine right here. My house is a little bit above, so this should be a perfectly fine place to set up my mine. Except for the visitors. Holy cow, holy cow, holy cow. Wow, that was cl that was really close. Hopefully I do not get any more sneaky zombies or I'll probably die. Um, but anyway, this mine is going to be going to go down to bedrock and then we're going to go up a little. And um, and then we'll stretch it and do some strip mining to find some diamonds. But um, we might not get that far in this episode. And it's pretty unlikely. But I'm going to make like a... I'm going to make it look good. And I like two, uh, two wide mines. In my opinion, they look a lot nicer. And it's a habit for me to... Uh, place torches on the right side um it's just like i do it because when you're searching through caves and if you place them on the right side on the way out they'll be on the left side so i never get lost in caves yay it also helps me find the stuff that i lost um because i'll remember where i went with with um help from the torches so that's just a tip you guys don't have to follow that and i am finding nothing not a single bit of iron not a single bit of ore. Ore is so scarce in this game. You really have to look to find it. Which stinks. I don't like when I have to look for stuff. But it does make the Let's Play more interesting. When I... It gets it gets more intense. It gets, gets more rewarding once I... Once I find such materials. I don't think I had to break that, did I? I just switched. Alright. Sorry about that. Let's keep going. And hopefully we will find some stuff or at least bedrock so I can branch out to find possibly more ores and hopefully diamond that would be so good <laughs> so good anyway this picks about to break and I need to place another torch 
did bring... Whoa! Do I have two more? It's hard to tell with this inventory. It's a little weird. Alright, so... Yeah, I have... This is the last... This is the last pick. Until... I find some iron, which should be... Any minute now, hopefully. Um... Giving my pick a break. I love that we can find flint now. That's so good. They really need to add caves, though. Because the only thing that would make it... The, the caves would make slower, in my... In my knowledge... The only thing that it would make slower is the world generation. Which is already really slow, so... It doesn't really make a difference. I wait for my worlds to generate for a little while. So I'm pretty sure a little more waiting time just to generate some caves wouldn't be too wouldn't be too bad, but I don't know. If it's not too much to ask from Mohong, Mojang, whatever you like to say, I personally say Mojang. It sounds much more English saying it like that. If, if you know what I mean. I'm not even sure I know what I mean. Oh, gosh. All right. So, this is pretty lonely out here, just finding dirt and cobble and gravel. This is horrible. Maybe I shouldn't have picked that spot to mine. I have to be around bedrock. I don't think that's the surface. I think that right there, what you guys are looking at, I think that is just the fog. Because I'm building this huge underground cave, which is huge for Joe Pass Gaming's new weekly contest thing, and it's underground bases this time. So I'm building a huge underground base. And it's and it looks like it's light on half of it because it's so big and the fog render uh, makes it look bright, so that's why. Holy cow. This is crazy. Um No iron and I've gone down so much. This is crazy. But here's my number. <laughs> oh wow. Wow. Um, this is not good. At all. There's been nothing but cobble, dirt, and gravel. Coal! Yay! Oh my gosh. You know how horrible that is? Way to be nice to me, game. Alright, so, let's see how far I actually did go down, because I think that that is not the entrance, but I probably was wrong. That does look like the entrance. Alright, so that is, um, we still dug really far down. I'll show you what I mean by the fog render. See, it looks bright down there. What in the world? Crate. What? Oh. I can hit you through the door. The top part of the door. What you gonna do? Yeah, there's a zombie spawning glitch where they spawn in daylight. Look at this. It's so bright in here. How do they spawn? Alright, let me put away some... Whoops. Put away some of my cobble. Well, I have to, have to hold it, really. <laughs> or not hold it. I can't hold it. I have to keep tapping. Is there any way to put it all in? Whatever. Oh, great. Alright, so. We are going to make some sticks with the last of our wood. 
and oops, go ahead and craft two more picks because you never know what'll be down in our mine. But at night the fog render is dark. So during the daytime it can look like it's daytime in the bottom of your cave. So it's kind of weird but um, I'm sure they'll fix that. It's just a no big deal. It's no problem. I'm personally fine with it. So it's just like a fun fun fact. Probably wasn't very fun but you know. Sweet, now I can make more torches. I only had three. Takes a quite a bit just to mine some measly coal. Even though there was coal, like, up, like, visible, up on the surface, whatever. Um, can't wait for, uh, whoa, can't wait for... 0 0.4.0 to come out. Let me just clog up most of this. Just so nothing spawns in that. And we'll continue digging. Continue mining. Hopefully we will reach the bedrock level soon. So we know where to branch off. To find iron, diamond, redstone, and gold, and all that. Because who doesn't want those amazing things? But I can't make any more torches because I don't have wood. I already had 42. I already had 42 coal. Hmm. Go figure. Ah, oh, gosh. Alright, so looks like I'm going to go dark caving. Apparently. So right when I reach bedrock, I think this video is going to end. Sorry if it was boring, I'm just mining, but I didn't want to, like, leave you guys out of too much, you know, because I, I built a ton of the house off camera because it was pretty boring, or it would have been boring watching me dig out holes in a mountain, so hope this makes up for it, and, um, hope you guys liked it, um, but I'm not going to try to end it abruptly because I don't know how much farther I have to go. Can't be too much farther. I've gone so far. Um, I've gone so far down. This is incredible. Thought I saw bedrock particles. Do they even have those? Do they have bedrock particles? I would imagine they don't, because particles cause lag. Oh! There it is. Bedrock. Alright, so let's go one, two, three, four, five, six, and I'm just going to do a little branch mining. Just a little bit. Not too fancy schmancy, but just about until this pick breaks. This is diamond level right here. This better work out for me. My last torch. Holy schmoles. Finding nothing. What I do best. Holy cow. I dug all the way down to bedrock, and all I found was coal along the way. Alright, that's all guys. Please leave a like, and um, I'll see you.